Well, I first want to thank the Greater Phoenix Chamber for this recognition. It's um, truly an honor. It's um, particularly meaningful to me personally because two years ago, I was an ivory tower neurosurgeon at the University of California in San Francisco doing my brain surgeries, doing my articles and textbooks and things. And one of the things that I found lacking was this entrepreneurial spirit in healthcare. So in looking for a change, I, I found that in Arizona. I um, happened to be um, called up by my mentor, Dr. Robert Spetzler, who was retiring, and he recruited me here to take over the helm at, uh, at Barrow. And he challenged me to come up with an innovative strategy for our institute, something I call Barrow 3.0, because I'm the third in this sequence from Dr. Green, who founded our institute, to Dr. Spetzler, and then myself. This, this strategy is about innovation. You heard in the video about our Barrow Artificial Intelligence Center. You heard in the video about the new research centers with IV uh, for brain tumor research. And you heard about some of the initiatives that we've uh, begun with Arizona State University in neuroengineering. These are examples of things that we think represent innovation for this community. You saw the best you on the streets. Uh, we have a new building where all of these pieces will fit into place and really accelerate our growth and our uh, future of innovation. We view Barrow as an engine for innovation. It's a tremendous team. There is so much talent in our, our group there, and we believe in this mission of what we do. We have a saying that we believe in. It's accept challenges, reject norms, and push boundaries. That's sort of the spirit of Barrow and the spirit of innovation that we live by every day as we try and make this a world-class destination for healthcare in neurosciences. So again, I thank you for the recognition. It means so much to us, and I look forward to engaging with the business community and having a bright future ahead. Thank you.